Now this is part two of the Global Citizen Festival that happened um, just uh, yesterday, 24th. Now we have already, if you have not watched the part one, go and watch it where we tackle Stoneboy's performance, AM, Thames, Uncle Waffles, Stormzy, John Legend, all their performances. Jackie. Now we are on Sir Akwadia's performance. Sir Akwadia performed. After that, Akufado came on stage, they booed him. Ghanaians were just doing boo, boo, boo. That was Yawa. Now, uh, Susa also performed. After Susa's performance, I'm not talking about Araba Lawson. <laughs> I, I am not talking about Araba Lawson. I'm talking about Susa, S-Z-A, from America. And also, Asha performed. Now, this is um, the rundown of what happened from Aisa Akodia to Asha's performance. I'm the headless YouTuber, this headless reactions. I like to The kind of energy that Sir Akodia came on stage with, you would think he has drank a gallon of some energy drink. <laughs> I, you would think he has drank a gallon of some energy drink. Now, um, Storm Energy Drink and Puma Storm Drink and also Away Drinking Water is doing a promotion where if you buy the, the drinks, look on the bottle, you see a four digit code on the bottle, text it to star 780 hash. Choose the second option and you can stand a chance of winning an all expense paid trip to Qatar to go and watch the FIFA World Cup. You can also win amazing prizes like microwave ovens, um, fridges, home theaters, mobile phones, free drinks and a lot. Yes, so join the promotion and stand a chance of winning something very nice from Casa Preco. Now let's go to Sir Akwadia's performance. Sir Akwadia proved that he is the landlord. His performance started with so much energy. Watch this video. of the Republic of Ghana, Nana Ekufu Adon. Who is enjoying themselves more? Us here or them in Central Park, New York? Who is enjoying themselves more? president huh? but anyway yes that is the yawa that happened the president of ghana was booed but he's a hard guy he finished his speech he even you know put some jokes in there now after a um the president left susa one of the top most uh, um uh, artists that were built for the night came to perform now this lady was somehow skeptical because this is her first time in africa her first time in ghana and she didn't know that anybody knew her songs over here. But the way people were jamming to her songs, she was surprised. Watch this video. Okay. 
I feel so blessed. I've never been to Africa before in my whole life. And I was scared that y'all wouldn't know my music. I clap for the internet, clap for the internet. <laughs> I clap for the internet. The internet is doing wonders. For someone who has never been to this part of the world, her songs have reached here. And um, people were singing to her songs and all that. And you have to know that, yes, the internet is really doing wonders. Now, Asher Raymond, the, the star of the show, came to perform. His performance was so energetic. Aside he performing and confusing the Gen Z people because Gen Z people don't know who Asha is. They don't know Larry Bird. <laughs> I, aside the Gen Z people not knowing who Asha is. And they were confused. Now, who is this that everybody is singing a Gen Z, a Asha's song, and Gen Z is just sitting there waiting for Chris Brown or a your friend say Oxley. But anyway, Asha came to perform and he introduced three artists. Three Nigerian artists onto the stage. He introduced Oxlade. He introduced Tiwa Savage and also Fields. This is how his um, performance started and how he introduced these artists. Watch this video. It's so hard for me to say this But it's coming from my heart Been a long time coming so, to You guys don't mind if I bring one of you on out here, right? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, give a warm applause For my brother yeah, yeah, yeah. Gentlemen, I got one more guest for you. Or maybe two. You guys want another one? This is special for you, ladies and gentlemen. Put your hands together for the one, the only, T.Y. Savage. Whoever has whatever to say, 
say it at your own will. At the end of the day, you know, the show was nice. Now, Asha brought, um, came to perform with DWP, which is Dance with Purpose, Dance God Lloyd, his group, you know, Dance God Lloyd and Afrobeast, their group. Yes. Now, they came to have a super performance with Asha. She said the dancing and stuff amidst the fireworks, you know. Watch this video. If you didn't watch it on I uh, um if you didn't watch it or you weren't there, please you can get, go into the description. You see the link to the um the full concert. You can watch it and enjoy yourself. But so far, this is what happened. And people are passing comments like, "Why did Asha bring three Nigerians and Sarkodia didn't bring anybody?" Just as some of you there, everything you have something to say about it. I will not even encourage that discussion. All I can say is the show was very nice. And Nyamisha Boni. Hi. <laughs> yes. God bless a Boni. Because the production was on point. There were no yawa, a, no um, malfunction, no nothing. Everything was scripted. Everything was running smooth. The live stream was, um, I think, an hour late. But it was also very streamlined and very nice. At the end of the day, the concert ended when it was supposed to end. And everybody went home. Everything was nice. And this is how Bruni will do it. Oh. <laughs> I, we're just hoping that our own people will learn something from this and we can also have top tier production like this in Ghana in the future. VGMA, 3 Music Award, all the other programs. We're just hoping that they can learn something from this. Time consciousness and all that. Some people didn't a um didn't see um your friend is saying didn't see Stone Boy's performance because they thought this is the same a, a foam production now that they are always late, you no. Know? So when Stone Boy was performing, a lot of people were not uh, around. They were now on their way. Time consciousness was a plus for this event. Production quality, the teamwork, synergy between uh, your friend is saying, and uh, synergy between all these um. All these performances, switching and all that, it was flawless and seamless. So yes, Global Citizen Festival was very nice and I loved it. And I don't know, watch other videos on this channel. Tell somebody about Headless. Yeah,